I've never been able to understand how they can run a dinner at a profit in the country at such a loss. You know, there'd be one way to make sure that crime doesn't pay. Let government run it. <laughs> now, if it seems that I'm picking unduly on the opposition, please note that I'm picking on the leadership of the Democratic Party. Because I'm sure that there are millions of fine patriotic members of that party who are deeply disturbed with what has taken place in the nation's capital as we moved from 1960 and the new frontier to the great society. They know that the great society is not the wave of the future. It's the end of an era. Federal employees have increased two and a half times as much as the increase in population in these last eight years. And the payroll has gone up seven and a half times as much and government spending has gone up eight and a half times as much. The federal government spends $425 million a year just on public relations to tell us how well they're treating us and how prosperous we are. Never have so few spent so much telling us so little. If you want to spend more than you earn, you use credit. And there are many situations where this is justified. Things which are based on the sound hope that future income will be higher and then just justify the use of credit. You may not use credit just to live it up and enjoy a better life than you can afford. And the rules are the same for a nation as they are for us as individuals.